Flash floods inundated several parts of Penang following continuous overnight rain. Residents at Block K of Kampung Batu Maung were furious when floodwaters gushed into their homes for the third time this year. Retired factory worker Saidin Ghazali got a rude awakening when a torrent of flood water gushed into his home in the wee hours of the morning. He never imagined the flood water exceeded the 0.3 meter concrete barrier which he built in front of his house. Housewife Rosna Rahim said the flood damaged cars belonging to her husband and son, which was already repaired due to the July flooding. Now they have to spend thousands of ringgit again to repair the damaged cars. Batumaung Assemblyman Dato Abdul Mali Abu Qasim said several factors caused the flood. Among them, he said, was the Jalan Batumaung upgrading project, inconsistency in the sizes of the drains, and the haphazard pattern of the drains causing drainage connectivity problems. He urged the Public Works Department, or JKR, to come up with a new design to increase the drain size in Jalan Batu Maung, as well as the construction of a second water retention pond. Over in Kapalabatas on the mainland, more than 50 houses in several villages were flooded. The continuous rain caused Sungai Laha Endin to overflow, thus submerging the villages in almost half-metre deep water. In Kampung Lahar Ikan Mati, odd job worker Muhammad Sani Harun said the villagers are concerned as the flooding had gotten more frequent. More than 500 homes affected on the mainland, with Kampung Bengali in Sungai Puyu, Kampung Machang in Taman Simpang Ampat being listed as among the more severely hit areas.